Our next bout ready to go in the red corner is Chopper. What can you tell us about him? Chopper there has a combination lifting and clamping arm that he can use to hold his opponents or flip them over and try and toss them out of the ring. And his opposition, Killer Lotus. Who's that? Uh, that one there being driven by Travis from Travco Industries has a horizontal spinning bar on top. That'll rip ro uh, robots apart very quickly. Oh, those look sharp. I noticed that he had a guard on before, uh, while he was putting the robot into the arena. Yeah, that's really important. You want to make sure you don't get bit by that thing because that'll tear more than just metal off. All right, we're ready to go. Three, two, one, fight! Already Travis has got his spinning blade going up. That's really important. Quickly getting, oh my, we already got one of those eyes coming off of Ethan's robot over leaving, there, Chomper. Leaving parts behind. Yeah, that's one of his signature items. He likes to put all those in all of his robots. Sparks are literally flying here today. Oh yeah, chewing away really nicely at that titanium armor plate on top. Getting underneath and the, to the softer stuff too. Both of them jockeying around each other, hoping to get a better position to be the first one to attack. Chomper gets Whoa. him up on end. That's he's, an interesting He's got to try and get himself down or else he's going to get counted out. He's only got 10 seconds to show that he can control himself. What's going to happen here? He's trying, but he's got that thing spinning, hoping he can knock himself over. I don't think he's going to be able to, though. He's pretty stuck there. There's no way that Chomper wants to give him the chance. Down on his backside now, but he oh, can still drive inverted, moving which is really around. important for these robots. Oh, bounces himself off that hazard there, but a good way to get right-sided. Back right way up. Once again, getting around behind each other, hoping to push each other out the sides. Ooh, nice one off that red hazard. A great sparring match so Another far. Another one, too. He's got him. Now that clamper is doing exactly what it's designed to do, holding his robot steady there, trying to drag him towards the outside. And it's a push and pull of fight right now. Uh, Another hard one for Chomper off the blue hazard there. You can see how well that lifting arm works on Chomper. He's able to flip himself over immediately. Killer Lotus now upside down, not nearly as effective with his weapon that way, but he is still able to drive. If he can somehow get himself to that hazard or against the wall, he might be able to flip himself back over. He's trying. <laughs> Doing a little more damage to himself more than anything, though. Uh, pieces are being left behind. There's going to be some repairs needed after this one. Yeah, there's just a little over a minute left for this fight. Spinning up that weapon, hoping to do some damage, even though he's upside down. Lots of sparks coming off of it. You see Chomper madly flipping his flipper there, hoping to be able to get his opponent up on end. So far, a very entertaining bout from these two robots. Yeah, they've both been very aggressive, both going after each other as much as possible. And that's going to be really important if it goes to the end of time and it comes to a judge's decision. See lots of plastic or foam, something black coming off in the corner there. Chomper will over and over again, just flipping his opponent end over end. Ooh, nice hard one off the sidewall. Chomper's holding him in the corner there. He's stalling out. He's only got 10 seconds to hold him there, but he wants to do that to show that he's in control of this match. That's also really important near the end. Only 20 seconds left. Killer Lotus getting some blows in before the end of the match. Chomper once again using that lifting arm to great avail. Ah, nice Ooh, one off that flipped up onto the hazard. Less than 10 seconds. I think this one's going to a decision, although it's getting close to that edge. Only got a few seconds left. Ah, time up. So yeah, this is going to go to a judge's decision. What they're going to do for this one now is they're going to have to judge it on three different categories based on the damage, control, and aggression demonstrated by both drivers. Whoever was able to do the most of all three will be the winner in this match. As we can see, these sparks just flying on the replay here. Yeah, that spinning horizontal bar just chewing at the underneath the chomper. Well, that's one way to sharpen a blade. <laughs> wow. Yeah, you can see them both very good drivers, just trying to get behind each other as much as possible. Chomper using that lifting arm, getting him up on end there. That was so close to being a knockout for him. And the winner announced by split decision is Chomper. A round of applause. You know, it was a really close matchup there. I wasn't really sure who's going to take it, but Chomper really did show the most aggression on that one. He was just constantly at him over and over again.